Hey, what's up you guys? So I have another hair mask for you all to grow your hair longer in just one week. If you're someone who is trying to prevent hair fall or you're just trying to grow your hair longer or thicker or stronger, then this is the mask for you because it does all of those things. So without further ado, let's start with the ingredients. So the first ingredient is going to be, of course, coconut oil. And I think that if you really wanna have longer and stronger hair, you have to have coconut oil in your hair care routine, especially because coconut oil has so many benefits for your hair. The oil is very strong in promoting hair growth because it gets deep into your hair follicles and promotes a lot of scalp health. And it's also going to stimulate a lot of blood circulation, which also means faster hair growth. So I would really encourage everyone to incorporate coconut oil in into their hair care routine for longer and stronger hair. So I just added one tablespoon of coconut oil and then I also added in one tablespoon of raw honey. And your honey doesn't have to be raw. I just like my honey raw because it's not processed and I just want the ingredients to be pure. So honey also has a lot of benefits for hair. It's known to strengthen hair follicles for healthy growth. It will also add a lot of moisture and nourishment to your hair. So it's also a great ingredient to use in this hair mask. The next ingredient is going to be rosemary essential oils. Now I think that this ingredient is the most important part of this whole combination, especially because it's known for promoting a lot of thickness in your hair and preventing excessive hair fall, balding, graying, and it just gives your hair its best health. And rosemary is one of the most well-known and strongest essential oils to promote hair growth. So if you guys are interested in getting an essential oil, I would really recommend you getting rosemary essential oils because it has the best benefits for hair. So I added exactly five drops of the rosemary into the bowl and then I mixed all of the ingredients together to create one of the best combinations to grow hair longer and faster. I then took the hair mask and applied it to my scalp for about five to 10 minutes. And then during this time, I also did the inversion technique, which is also a great way of promoting even more blood circulation in your scalp. And I would also recommend you guys to apply this to the ends of your hair for a lot of nourishment, but I didn't do it in this video because I was just really in a hurry. I really wish I showed you guys, but it's really simple. Just apply it to the ends of your hair for more moisture. And by doing this, you don't have to apply too much conditioner in the shower. So this is a great technique of getting that extra shine and hydration. I then put my hair into a bun and then I also applied a plastic bag over my hair to really lock in the ingredients in my hair and into my scalp when you apply the plastic bag over your hair it allows the hair mask to work a lot faster and a lot more efficiently so if you're in a rush to get the hair mask to work faster then applying a plastic bag is a great way to do that and then after one hour i rinsed off the hair mask with water first. I didn't just go in with my shampoo or conditioner. I actually spent time to really rinse off the hair mask. And then after I felt like the hair mask was completely rinsed off, I continued with my normal shower routine of just washing my hair with shampoo and then conditioner. And if you're trying to grow your hair a couple inches in a week, then I would recommend using this mask at least two to three times that week. You can also use this mask every single day for just one week. So don't do it every single day for one month. That's gonna cause you a lot of hair fall, but if you do it every single day for just one week, that's going to grow your hair really fast. And if you do use this mask for every day in a week, then you're only gonna wanna do that per month. So you can't do two weeks in a month, you only have to do one week. And I really hope that wasn't confusing. If it was, I'll try to explain myself more in the description box below. But I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below for weekly videos just like this one. Thank you all so much for watching and I hope to see you all in my next video. Bye guys.